Hi everybody, my name is An Chan Tekka Chan. I'm going to give a quick look at Windows 11. Many years ago, marks of this state that Windows 10 is the last operating system. And they're going by this service pack, as known as Builds. Now, out of nowhere, they introduced Windows 11. Now, I'm thinking to myself, Windows 11? I thought they're going to say Windows 10 is the last one. And Windows 10 will have each builds. But why they have Windows 11? I don't know. When I first time heard about it, I got this um, preview version. When I heard about Windows 11, it'll be upgraded by the Insider Preview channel. Now, in this case, I'm using my laptop. Now, here's my Dell laptop for years. Unfortunately, it's not solid state, but just a regular hard drive. But it's good. But it's got a good amount of RAMs and CPU, which is i7, which is good enough. When I had this new build, they gave me Windows 11 as a insider preview. In this video, I'm going to show you what Windows is all about. We have here got my desktop, some nice blue rows. I'm using my Wi-Fi because I'm on my laptop. So I got my Myra Bytes and uh, my built-in antivirus, which is Windows Defender. We have here, we got start menu in the middle. It looks like iOS lookalike actually, which is weird, but interesting. Today in history, Edge Store. Let's start from start menu. It looks like a um, Google Chrome app lookalikes. All apps. Let's look at a new style start menu. It looks good actually. These are my apps I got. Huh, another welcome. Don't know what this is all about. I don't know why I got two Skypes. I think one's the software version and one's the app version. But to me, they're both the same. Might hear some noise in the background, which is my laptop. As noise as I'm I'm on battery, so I was charging up at the same time. So I was charging up whilst as we speak. Let's go to File Explorer. Soften up. Bear in mind it's a it's a hard drive, not solid state. Hmm, interesting. It's got desktop, my folder called Andrew, that's me. This PC. Looks like it looks alright actually. It's a new style. I had this feature since the new build. But it looks like Windows 11 has this kind of build. Oh, nice. I'm not going to go into it though. I'm just showing you a quick look actually. Let's go to settings. Okay, so we have here, we have a um, sort of control panel look like. Dell N150 is one and five that's the name of my laptop. I'm logged in as me on my Hotmail account. I'm using my Insider Preview. You have Bluetooth device. It's turned off. Network and internet. It's my Wi-Fi. I'm a, yeah. Personalization. Oh, I'm going to explore a little bit. See what we have here. Search, start menu, pin menu, apps.
<laughs> Fuba. It's one more another media player I got actually. With VLC, my jigsaw, my bytes, maps, office, scan, team viewer. It's quite nice actually. Accounts. Time and language. I don't like this this layout here. I don't want it to change to like 0107, but I'll look into that anyway in the future. Gaming, so that's linked to Xbox. Accessibility. I'm not gonna go and I'm not gonna go into it deeper actually. Actually, I might look into this one first. Windows security. Okay, it's not bad. Find my device. You can do a tracking on it if with your Hotmail account. Encryption, developers. I think I got my developers turned on, so I'll do my inside preview. Windows update. I'll go install this, but I'll install it later. It's quite good actually. Let's close this. Let's go to Marks of Store. See what it looks like. It's a very good interface actually so far. See all the list here. You got apps. This is on the preview mode by the way. For gaming. It's quite a good new interface. Hey, <laughs> it looks like built John Wayne a bit. That picture. Entertainment. Hey, look, this film here. Let's go to library. This is stuff I got actually. Well, I don't have that. I just I need some more of this stuff. Treasure maps. Add blocks. Yep, yeah. add blocks. Good. Back to home. It's very good actually this Microsoft Store interface. I cannot complain about it so far. To me I like the new look. This is a widgets. Okay that's not out yet, still testing. I can do a search from here. Like Instapic. Instapic is like a a Microsoft version of Instagram. I don't think that's I think that's discontinued now. But we always called a Microsoft version of Instagram because many years ago there's an original Instagram app and you can't upload pictures. So Instapic yeah, I can upload pictures, Instagram pictures. But I'm not sure about can you upload pictures now? Probably you can upload pictures from the PC now, but that's back then. How about calculator? Oh, looks good. Looks nice. If I go star menu, I go here, I can do shut down, restart. And let's go to start settings. Okay, that's like a personalization. Let's open Word before I go because and Edge and Edge. Let's put Edge also. Ha! Huh, why is Gordon Ramsay so mean? Back in the days, yeah, I was looking up at Gordon Ramsay. 
Let me just read from the list. And he's very hard hitting with Gordon Ramsay. So you watched um, Kitchen Nightmares. He's very foul, but at the same time, he can argue saying um, he's trying to help a lot of people. He got to be harsh to help, unfortunately. And that's the way it is. So I just put that out here. And let's look at Edge. I mean, I could use that one, but this is fine. Not bad. Ah, stupid. Eh? Quite good actually. So far, I'm very impressed so far. And there you have it. And that's the end of this quick tour of Windows 11. Please let me know what you think of Windows 11 so far. Do you like it? Is it going to be like the new Windows 10? Could it be the next Windows Vista or Vista 2.0? Would it be improved? Well, in my opinion, it's going to be a good operating system, but I wish it would just remain Windows 10 because having a Windows 10 for a long time would be makes it easy for business. But now we've got Windows 11 comes in now. They're going to talk about Got to upgrade to Windows 11 as part of the business requirements because of Microsoft did this, but I can't say bad about Windows. I can't say bad about Windows 11. I like Windows 11, but they could have stick with Windows 10 with this new builds. That was a better, best way forward for me. That's just, and that's just my opinion. And I like to thank you for viewing, and chat out.